Make a stack, Pepe laugh, got all of these bitches mad She saw me and I do not give a dance, I feel like Twitch staff Clip that, ay, this bitch finna give me whiplash Took my fucking What the fuck is up guys, welcome back to the channel man I hope everyone's doing it well Hope everyone's excited for this video man Gonna be checking out the latest mixtape by Lil Darky Lost Songs with fucking 18 tracks spanning from it looks like from 2019 and up to uh, up to 2022 i'm excited for this man i'm uh you know i'm expecting a kind of variety of things really hoping for um like some composition 11 type tracks i can see clearly type tracks definitely feel like we're gonna have um i i don't know i just feel like this is gonna be a, a very mixed kind of assortment of tracks man you already know i had to pull out the motherfucking darky hoodie with the oh shit on the side with the motherfucking you know you know the hoodie the hoodie not the sweatshirt and they're dropping more merch uh sometime i think they said this month so uh be on the lookout for that this is not sponsored i'm saying a lot of y'all be asking like oh where do you get your uh, little darky merch like boulevard.com uh, follow them on Instagram, man. That's gonna be all like this. little darky merch, Spider Dane related merch. Check them out. It's Plague Boulevard. But here we are, man. Little darky dropping this thing for us again, gifting us on his motherfucking birthday, uh, like he did last year with Trap Metal. That is one of my uh, most watched videos to this day. Kind of nuts. Didn't you know? I'm not sure. Uh, I believe my video quality was not what it is now. It's very 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 shittier back then but uh but hey man people be you know people be fucking with it i guess i don't know anyways enough fucking talking enough chit chat y'all are here for the reaction let's get right into this thing man Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen low darky and the lost songs is what it says on the album cover here like i said 18 tracks about 44 minutes this video is going to be well over an hour so uh, buckle up, stay tuned, fast forward, rewind, do whatever the fuck you want to do to make it through this man, but uh, here we go, track one, Mary Jane. And only some of the tracks got like the year that they were, they were recorded? this is not you know a uh, composition 11 type of track and that is a, not a, like a very slow i don't know i don't know man that song damn near brings me to tears sometimes it has once like after the fucking after i saw them live but uh anyways man anyways but this song this is a nice I'm, you know this is a nice little vibe this is a nice little oh nice little feeling i got right now man let's fucking keep going This 
says still darky, right? I feel like it would say if there was. Yeah, this is featuring Wendigo. Kind of gives me uh, some Bremen God vibes. I'm, li I'm liking how this is sounding. Like, a lot. I can't help oh, I'll wait. I know Breathe relief into your chest. Oh man, on the vocals, man. Every time I wake up, you gotta take a hit. I'm trying to break up. Yeah, I know how you look without your makeup. Yeah, you don't got hey. a problem with me. Nope. Hey, what? Bitch. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, hey. What I I wonder when this was made, man. Definitely, a, definitely not a song. I feel like you can just drop. This is definitely like a mixtape song. I don't. Know. I mean, I just need to drop it as a single, but I don't see this being on like any of his other projects that he's released so far. But my uh, my thought earlier was uh, like I wonder if people hear this and they're just like super like turned off by it type shit like. They just they just want like streaming hardcore wild fucking little darky. They just don't even fuck with the slow like I can't even imagine people not fucking with the slow shit or like the stuff that sounds like this. I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. But Mary Jane very much fucking with that track. Going on the track too though we got Air Raid Freestyle. This is uh this year. Air Raid Freestyle Duo 2022. This is your command. See motherfucking Putin over here talking about uh, using nuclear weapons in U Ukraine and like we're at like the possibility of like Armageddon level nuclear event type shit is as high as it was back during the Cuban fucking missile crisis shit. Like, bro, what the fuck going on? What? Why can't we just live in fucking? Why can't we just let each other do our thing, bro? Why do? Eh, eh, man. Anyways. <laughs> oh, I spit in my listen to Shiva. I am a red dot Hindu. Jesus cool too, but I listen to Shiva. I see colors, they see black and white. <laughs> I feel like I was the giver. My last bitch 
Slept even oh, fuck my okay. nigga, my nigga, I couldn't forgive her. I got high standards for people. She like the whole fuck to deliver. Too many sips will fuck up your liver. Too many opiates fuck up your kidneys. Another rapper died off fentanyl. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, another rapper went like Kennedy. We are not each other's enemies. Uh, why are we warring like 200 BC? It is the 21st century. Uh, we got the knowledge to fix our planet, but can I see it objectively? Uh, dropping oh. a bomb till everything gone, and you in a hole like some Kennedy. Uh. Boy, speaking fucking facts. Damn, I would have liked it to just come back. You hear that, boys? It's time to kill some time. goddamn Nazis. I need ten Nazi scalps from every last one of you sorry sons of bitches before the sun goes down. Do you hear me? Sir, yes, sir. Inglorious bastards reference right there. Air raid freestyle, man. Fucking with that. Uh, really like um like whenever that bass hit that fucking that bass hit definitely cannot wait to listen to this in the car. Darky, you know, as he does so well, talking truth, speaking facts, man. But like going in at the same time. On to the next track that we got. Tats on my lean. Then kind of fucking high. This thing I ever watched this. For art, we're at an all time low. Nobody cares how you feel. My favorite song is about shooting people and popping pills. Uh, listen to my new song, Lincoln Bio. It's about shooting people and popping pills. I'm not trying to clown music that's about shooting people and popping pills. I'm just saying that it's doing something to us if you really think about it. Again. Speaking facts, bro. He's talking about truth. I hate this shit because this beat is so nice. This beat is so but <laughs> like on this part, he just made him fun of that shit, and it just it does the show, man. Like really, I mean, the beat is everything. <laughs> I don't want to like you know, I don't want to be bopping to go into this, but. This shit sounds hard, bro. He's proving the point. Oh yeah, I want to go do some opiates now. Yes, Again. A great idea. But I will say, man, I've never like listened to a song and where they're talking about like lean or doing Molly, Papa Molly, doing Oxy type shit. Like I've never listened to it and been like, I'm kind of, I kind of want to try it now. <laughs> like I've never. Never really, I don't, I'm sure that happens a lot. Like, I'm sure it's happened to people. I'm sure people like listen to that shit and then because of it, they want to go explore and do this and that. But, uh, not me, not I. I don't know, bro. I'm just built different. <laughs> I, 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 I don't know. But going on to track four, we got Believe Demo 2021. Old school. 
bap boom bap type beat. So, yo, is that the tone about the cure? They don't wanna let you shine too bright, cause if you do it right, your light will block out everybody's sight. And they might feel spiteful and bite, jaws clench, niggas get tight at you at this height. Nobody likes to lose, but somebody got a better you than me. Used to eat fruity loops, now I do sushi. Went from rocket fruit of the loom to loo. Bro, I like the message Believe. behind it. Believe. I'm a good person. Believe. Do you believe? Do you it was absolution he was after. I wasn't a priest. I will say real quick, like, you know, I don't like a lot of, like, boom bap soundy type of songs um, that artists put out, like, current artists put out. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what it is. It's just not really, uh... It, it can be done well. Sometimes it's just like, eh, this is... It's not really... For me, honestly, like Bones is, is a big artist that you know I fucking I love Bones, bro. But a lot of his uh like the boom bappy type sound, I don't know. It's just I can't really. It's not for me, I guess. But everything I've heard from uh, Darky Man that whenever he does this boom bap shit, I don't know. I it it hits differently. Like it, I really uh, kind of resonates. Oh shit! That ass just fucking hold up. <laughs> Let's take this fucking hoodie on, bro. Believe. Believe. I'm a good person. Believe. Do you believe? Do you believe? It was absolution he was after. I wasn't a priest. Maybe the distinction between therapy and confession. Ain't no problem, though. No. We got the believe. fucking shirt underneath. Believe. <laughs> believe. Woo! Believe. believe. He's got double darky. Believe. Let me fucking. Jump. Let me take the. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Let me fucking take this shit off real quick. All right, we back, we back. Oh, they had me baptized at birth. My mama said that birth in me hurt. Been with the shit since I was popping out on mama's shirt. I knew I would be great. The first Indian rapper that isn't fake. A slept on. Worker, you get stepped on. Nothing that you spit and really sticking like Teflon. I lay down a verse in one take. Now what's the next song? Everybody <laughs> come to me for gas. I'm a Chevron. Everybody think they know me. That's the part they get wrong. You live with your parents. I'm not the biggest fan of this boom bap type of sound. Well, I don't know what the fuck it is about whenever Lil Darty's on it, like whenever he does it, but like I said, it just it hits. I fucked with it, man. Could be, I don't know, just what he's saying, the delivery that he got going on. I'm sure it's a mixture of all these things, but but believe is no different, man. Definitely fucking with the, the message behind this, what what is being said here. On to the next song, we got Untitled 2 featuring Wendigo. On vocals or just production? Check, check. Check, check, check. Check. One day I was walking my dog on a nearby trail like I usually do. It was a cold Friday afternoon. And I noticed the same man that I had seen over an hour ago was behind me about 300 yards on the trail. And I started to wonder, who is this guy? What does he want? Is he following me? And uh, about when I decided it would be a good idea to turn around and leave, that's when my dog decided he wanted to take a shit. There's a bad man loose in the neighborhood and he wants to take your life, your life. There's a bad man running from the neighborhood. 
Definitely got some uh, teenage disaster type of vibes going on. Speaking of which, he got a track that we gotta check out as well uh, after this. Is it fair? Is it fair? Is it right? No, it's not, but he does it anyway. There's a bad man running around the neighborhood. He could kill you any day. After I bent over to pick up the dog shit, I stood up straight to look for the man and he was gone. I couldn't see him anywhere. So I went back home and did the rest of my work for the day and sat down on the couch to watch some TV and eat dinner for the evening. I flipped through the channels a little and figured I'd settle on the news. It had been a while since I caught up with any current events. The room went cold. I can hear my heart beat. Why is my dog on TV? There's a bad man running around the neighborhood. You can see him on the news. There's a bad man running around the neighborhood. And he'll make you pay your dues. That track, very, very uh, teenage disaster type of uh, sound, type of feel. Especially, you know, if you fuck, if you listen to teenage, then you, you know exactly like you. I'm not speaking bullshit or nothing. This is uh, like you get me, you get me. Not a bad thing, not a bad thing at all. I'm just simply saying. Go on to the track six, lay down demo 2021. So I recorded half this song and just never did the rest of the song. Not what I was expecting, what the fuck? Looking at you right now, I can tell you one thing. Don't blink. You might miss something. Looking at you right now, I can tell you both of my eyeballs sting. I blinked. Did I miss something? Tell me, I don't got time for the horseshit bullcrap, motherfucker, what did you think? I think. I think. I'm the type of motherfucker made out of ink. Under your skin, everybody is pink. You are blind. Everything's inside your mind. I am finishing this verse a year later. Slow it down for you to hear, because I know most of you are dumb. When confronted with a challenge, most people just turn and run. Life will chew you up and spit you out like you're a piece of gum. Mm. <laughs> I'm just having fun. Life is like a game you gotta play that no one's ever won. When people ask me who do I fuck with, I just tell them none. I don't fuck with nobody but. Nobody but hey. God, I feel like I'm a priest. Yes. I just sit back, relax in my chair, and watch the racks increase. Yes. Every meal I eat, a banquet. Every snack I have, a feast. Yes. He was talking shit, and so I laid him down on his teeth. Lay down. Lay Curse on that boy. Lay down, man. Another track I'm heavily fucking with. Uh, I didn't, you know, honestly, wasn't sure uh, what to really expect going into this thing. Just a kind of a variety of tracks of, of sounds. I'm, you know, I'm very much liking what I'm hearing. I do like the little inclusion that he had of like I'm recording this verse one year later, just throwing that into the track. Like he said, like he's kind of just having fun with this shit. On to the next track though, we got Sif Sisyphus Drunk. I suppose drunk. I don't know how to say that word, man. You are Freestyle, though. May you roll this boulder up this mountain until the end of time. Yeah, cripple and depression, moving weight like I'm Sisyphus. Moving weight. 
away forever. Sisyphus. Move away forever, huh? Crippling depression, moving away like I'm Sisyphus. Uh, Crippling depression, but I never ever been a bitch. Uh, never been the one to flex. Lately, I've been in the gym. Uh, sipping lean with Edison, cry still in Jehiah to him. Uh, taking out the trash, I'm with Salsa, he called that the bin. Uh, bitch, I'm drunk as fuck. When I'm rapping, you can hear me grin. Ohio goes, I'm on smoke, no, I'm on my darky son. Genki the sky, I'm feeling great, thank you for asking, son. Machine gun, old Daisuke, that says, and I really like my gun. I can catch a flow and spit a rap on top of any drum. Freestyling, I'm punching in, the shit is coming on my dome. I've been in the pocket like a jazz drummer found his own. I've been in the pocket like some lint that over time has grown. I've been in the pocket like your motherfucking telephone. Yeah, yeah, they let yeah, me do yeah. rolling loud, somebody tell my mom yeah, They let me do rolling loud, I should get up on stage and take a shit yeah. the Music game is a fucking joke, but ain't nobody laughing at yeah. it I got like 10 plaques, but don't nobody even give a shit uh, They let me do rolling loud, but on stage I can't even smoke no loud I guess that shit is just not allowed, this music shit is a fucking joke I used to sell dope because I was broke and I needed to make my rent I feel like Sisyphus, I move that weight forever again and again yeah. Crippling depression, moving weight like I'm Sisyphus uh, Moving away forever Moving, moving away forever huh? But I do like how uh, that little slurring And it definitely, I mean, I'm not tripping, right? It was definitely slurring I like how that sounded, man Again, Darky just kind of having fun with the shit And I'm doing his thing Going on to the next track that we got Running Away Slower track. For a lifetime, I've been waiting. Hit that vocal, man. said this bro but i love this man's versatility i love the singing shit that he does bro like to me it just sounds so fucking good i love that he puts out music that's like depending on what mood you're in bro like you can just listen to whatever the fuck you want like he has a variety of tracks to listen to it's not just like one sound it's it's and really giving you multiple options gotta love it bro gotta fucking love it Every day, sun come up on time. I'm procrastinating, hitting myself. Contemplating, sticking blades in myself. I take shrooms and I'm aware of myself. Half hurting, half saving myself. It's hard for me to take care of my health. Probably in my jeans like Bell. Probably in my cells like prison. Hard for me to believe my visions. What I see in my dreams forgotten. Half the time, cause the TAC disconnect me from where I've got it. I don't want to feel nothing, please. Everything in this world is right. This is definitely one of them songs, bro, like, if I'm in the right mood, this, if, like, I don't know, like, this is definitely a track I can see myself trying to, as weird as that sounds, it's definitely, it's like, like I said earlier, like, Composition 11, what is, what is that, like, the third, fourth time I mentioned that track? This is kind of in that same, you know, area. It's definitely, a, like, oh, again, bro, like, the right headspace, right fucking, everything's aligned, it's definitely a 
attracted to see myself crying to as weird as that sounds bro but it's just the truth damn good song really like this um, really like the song here man i was hoping and wishing for a track like this and we got it i'm satisfied 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 mixtape bro <laughs> 10 out of 10 don't need to fucking continue but going on to track 9 we got grpr2 which uh i can only assume is dance the rapper punk rock star 2 pretty sure that's right don't know what else it would be but uh yeah man here we go surprised if it was the same beat definitely a boros type beat though very fitting uh title honestly uh thinking just right now um i feel like this would have been sick to be at the end of it's a rapper punk rock star you know on boros kind of like a little silent pause i don't know like how long how long is a good pause man like and 20 seconds and then come in with this at the, at the end of the track i don't know man i don't know just just a thought just my little thoughts right now just uh you know off, off the fucking dome Definitely would have been nice on Boros, but uh, at least we got it now, man. On to track 10, Untitled 3. We got uh, some kind of shorter length tracks. Hit him with that. Alright, so so far we've had what teenage type song. Fuck, what was the other one? What was the other one that I said? Ah oh, man, I don't remember. And this is giving me a uh, gymnastics type type of sound type of vibes. I can't. I I cannot be the only one in this. <laughs> percent bro a thousand percent gymnastics type shit right here when i say it's like this is the type i'm not saying like darky's like trying to like copy them or like whatever nothing negative line i'm simply making a uh observation you know so far i'd say uh we're definitely 10 for 10 uh, i can see me listening to all these tracks no skips yet will that change i guess we'll see man track 11 time of the day 
Last few tracks are kind of just kind of flying by. They're so short. So far, the only track I can see myself uh, skipping. It's cool for what it is, man. Like, don't get me wrong, but I cannot, I cannot imagine myself like <laughs> listening to this whole thing play out. <laughs> not that long, not that long at all. I really like uh, the uh, the uh, just the thought. I never would have thought like putting what do you even call that type of sound? It reminds me of like restaurant type music. Like if there's a band in a restaurant playing, or like an old like a uh, Classy type of club type of thing. And my man just fucking spitting on it. I appreciate it for what it is, man. Will I be listening to it when it comes on? Like, I'm still gonna add it to my library, but this is definitely a uh, a skippable track. Let me know what y'all think about this track. On to the next song. We got Untitled One, Two, Three, and then One, right? Three, One. Every day I get up, every day I lay down, every day I get up, every day I lay down, every day I get up, every day I lay down, every day I get up, every day I lay down, every day you get up, but you can get laid down. Like you was a verse, I'm a man who makes sounds. Put me in the ring, I'll go for 92 rounds. In all my life, I probably smoked like 92 pounds. I remember Damn. back when my mother wasn't proud of me. But I can't blame her at the time, everybody doubted me. Nobody can know who the fuck I was about to be. Dropped acid and dark energy surrounding me. Every day, somebody telling me that I won't be shit. The modern MC will find a username to beef with. Do what you gotta do, but in this life, you gotta be quick. There ain't enough time in the day. We're in agreement. Too scared to step outside the box, cause you won't be rich, right? I'm having ego death, nigga, I could be this might. Attempted suicide, didn't know life could be this bright. And all I had to do was look inside and free this light. I'm on my, I don't give a fuck shit, I do what I want. Fuck all the shit you think you know, I'll roll it in my blunt. And smoke that shit in front of you and I won't pass it once. One day I just got up and I ain't lay down in months, little bitch. Alright, so listening to this track, I can definitely tell you for a fact that it's just like the way that he delivers bars uh, on these type beats that really like gets me into it and really makes me like the song in general. Like my man just killing it with the fucking delivery on this man, on these uh, boom bap beats. On to track 13, You Owe Me One. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. I show so much love to you motherfuckers, now you owe me one. If you hurtin', you are not the only one. Yeah, yeah, I stayed up so late last night, my eyes I can't even open them. I show so much love to you motherfuckers, now you owe me one. You owe me one. You owe me one. Unreciprocated love, my heart is not the phony one. I 
this shit, bro. I like this shit a lot. You owe me one, man. <laughs> I, I like that track. I really like that kind of like build up me thinking that it was going to be a slow track and then it kind of just like evolving, developing as a, you know, as the time progressed. Really like how uh, catchy this shit is sounding as well. Very, uh, very easy song to kind of just catch on, catch on to, you know. And on to the next one, we got Borat, Swamp B-Side 2020. Huh. Jesus, those hi-hats killing my ears, man. <laughs> My producer is a Jew. Uh, my producer is a Jew. My, my producer is a Jew. some uh isis type beat big war um type of vibes right there man really interesting how like how heavy hitting that beat was but it's like it's it's a fun type of sounding beat at the same time man like I was, i'm fucking with this track though i'm fucking with this track 15 you got a homophone homophone right homophone uh, homophone homophone Womp b-side 2020 as well Check, 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 check. Scott Skr? Scott Skr, man. Got a lot of production Let's on that. Let's get back uh, to basics to hey. the first square available. Spider Gang, the greatest ever done it, that's relatable. She called the nigga sis, and so I called that bitch a bitch because she bitch sis. I hate to break it to you, but this bag is juggling dicks is spitting shit that's undebatable. You're a fucking homophobe. Bitch, I love traps like it's home alone. You must be missing chromosomes. I mean, it is homophobe. I'm not black or white, there is a human in the mirror You assuming what my race is so that you could be a racist Tell me how I should behave based on genetic variations I've been patient with you people, patient with the system But he cannot feel the punch until it hits him with the fist I'm in the business of pissing off the listener If life's a bitch pissing her If I have pretty flowers every day with your money Even if your nose runny from all the pollen She the reason you exist in that all And you owe it to her underneath it I'm just a lonely motherfucker sure. compensating like you but not committed in a way I cannot say what is true And I'll admit it, man, I hate the way I come off the page Like maybe he's just making art and being edgy for plays But I have limited days And I take pleasure in inspiring, making rage on the stage So you don't feel like a waste A garbage can with a face And you can do the shit you want to really like this fucking, like, kind of hard-hitting beat Going into this fucking piano going Action going on, man Really, really liking that little uh, transition Definitely was unexpected But as I was saying earlier Scott Stir, a lot of production on a motherfucking 80 Proof Black's upcoming album, which drops uh, December, December, October, <laughs> on fucking Halloween, man. Fucking Halloween. Of course, your boy will be reacting to that shit. Probably my most, I mean, probably, it is my most anticipated album drop for the year. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. Be on the lookout. Be on the lookout for that motherfucking reaction video when, if, when it drops, you know, around, you know, it should either be, I don't know what time the album's going to drop. It's going to be like... Sunday night or sometime during Monday. Regardless, it'll be fucking the 31st or the 1st. 
Uh, anyways, let's fucking keep it going, man. Well, whatever the pace, cause it don't matter too much. At least that's what T taught me. That's why I splattered the brush. That's why I smoke tree partly. I'm in the back of the bus. Going to school, bumping oxy, cause the internet just. To ditch and tag under the bridge until it silhouette us. The sun's setting on my youth, but I am young in my heart. Becoming one with the art. Now you a character bark. Go make the people feel better, that's your character art. Are you aware of your part? This, bro. There's no one I can trust. Oh, who knows? Back. Now, this definitely should have been on Swamp, man. This definitely should have dropped. I think this might be my favorite true oh, I don't know it's a very close tie with I, th I think this might be my favorite track on here Mary Jane's pretty fucking uh, close behind I'm really fucking I'm loving this track I'm loving those transitions I'm loving uh, just the different sound and that we got throughout definitely wasn't expecting that to sound like that at all but very nice surprise man very much satisfied with that track 16 we got sold gang b-side 2019 Yang B-side? I know there's Yin. What the fuck is... <laughs> is there a Yang? Am I, am I missing something? Is there something on SoundCloud? Or not? Let me know guys, let me know. Are you surprised? To see me with your eyes? After all we both survived? Look at our lives. Uh 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 uh. Look at our lives. Sold, man. Nice little uh, chill type of song we got going on right there. Not, 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 not too chill. Not like motherfucking uh, running away. Not like that. But it was, it was a nice little, nice little vibe, man. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. On to the last, second to last track, track seventeen. Small. I want to say small dark one, but it's just small dark freestyle. That was gonna be a very very short song um barely over a minute long man very 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 fucking strong very hard minute you know he sounded very nice i like him acknowledging like some people just want to hear him streamed it's just i mean like i was saying earlier bro but you know to, to each their own track 18 if only you knew 
based on the title, I kind of want to say it's going to be a slower type of track, like I can see clearly type beat, but uh, let's see, man. I might be right. That reminds me of Fly Away. Oh. Some motherfucking like prom dancing, slow dancing, grab, 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 grab your lady, slow dance to type shit. I don't know, man. I love, you know, he started this mixtape off very fucking strong and he's ending it off just as strong. Oh, if you knew how much I need to hug you, then maybe you would still be there. album of just all singing back to back. Ain't that shit, man? I'm sorry, bro. I just I pictured like the music video for this track, like him walking on a beach wearing some fucking like white pants. Camera angle, angle to him like you know he walked in along the beach on the sand, waves just empty beach, waves you 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 can see like the ocean. That, that's what I'm, that's all I'm I'm picturing right now, bro. I don't know. It's it's going together so well in my mind. A couple of, like little flashback scenes. In this part, a little montage showing you the breakup and shit. Let me direct the video, man. <laughs> And then the video ends with him back at the girl's house, just knocking on the door. Fade to black, man. Fade to black, cut to black. Not sure which one I want. I want to do, but definitely like just you just leave it there. Like he he's at the house, knocking on the door. The the rest the rest is up to interpretation. <laughs> I don't know, bro. Like that's a whole little fucking man. I wish I could. Man, but uh. Like I said, definitely finishing off strong as shit. Just as strong as the fucking mixtape started. Oh man. Only you knew this is definitely gonna be one of the tracks that's on. Fucking repeat that I listen to a lot. Really fucking glad that uh you know he put this together, gave it to us, man. Again, 
just like last year, gifted us on his motherfucking birthday. 18 tracks. He did not have to fucking do 18 lost songs, bro. Like, that's a lot of songs. That was a fucking little darky for real, dude. I feel, I don't know, man, I don't know. Maybe he'll drop something in December. I feel like it's kind of far-fetched. Because, I mean, 18 tracks is a lot to kind of, like, hold us over. I mean, we just had fucking a uh, small dark one. Yeah, this year. When when did this drop? When did this drop? In June. Not that long ago, man. Regardless, whether uh, whether you guys are or not, I'm satisfied. I'm thankful. My man went ahead, went out of his way, and, uh, you know, did this shit for us. But that's all for me, man. I'm curious to know what you guys think of the uh, mixtape. Go ahead, let me know in the comments down below. Favorite tracks, the least favorite tracks, if any. All you guys are down there commenting. Not commenting, reading in the comments, whatever you're doing. Don't forget to like the video if you like the video. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you're not already. If you're new around here, whatever the reason may be, man, just go ahead and hit that sub button for your boy. Please and thank you. It is much appreciated. You guys have no fucking idea how much it means to me, man. For real. Until next time, it's been fun. Peace out, guys.